so hello again guys and welcome to the max 3d design channel so recently i received this comment great video thank you could you please show and explain how to create full collection of 1000 nft this way and this video was when i make this kind of um, ethereum sign and then i inserted in that studio and then the alien was rotating it so let's get started <laughs> So we have this, let's say, Ethereum, that's how it looks like, that we created in Fusion 360. Now let's open our DAS Studio and um, let's say for this lesson, how to make different like a collection that looks various, you know, like um, different styles. So let's create some kind of simple NFT. So let's use some people, let's say I want to use this face. Let's put some simple clothes on it. Let's say this Neon Dream outfit. Let's add some hair. Something without the force, so that it will be a little bit faster. Let's see how it looks. Looks cool. So now, let's say I want to put the Ethereum in front of her face, so it's kind of give a shadow on her face. So let's see what how it's gonna happen. So file, import, that's our diamond let's say 30 percent okay accept so there it is let's move it next to face okay now let's put it somewhere here now i want some kind of light shining on this ethereum so that it give a shadow on her face so let's create new spotlight let's call it just l accept now we go to our spotlight and we adjust where it, we want it to be shining so let's try that one now let's create camera so we want our face to be in focus first of all let's make it one by one so it's one by one and then let's make her eyes so select left eye and it will be pointing at Ethereum. Let's take the other eye and it will be pointing also at Ethereum. Let's change Ethereum. Mm. Shader. Let's make it red gem. Sorry, we need to go to surfaces. Choose Ethereum and use this one. So let's preview how it's gonna look with our NVIDIA IRA. Let's go to the light parameters. Let's create a camera. So now you kind of see like a print of the actual Ethereum on her face. So we can move Ethereum a little bit slightly back. Let's switch to the filament view so that we can work a little bit more faster. So let's say face will be somewhere here. Okay, let's switch to perspective view so that we don't move the camera. And then we're just going to move this one a little bit further. Let's switch to the cam and to the light. We can make Ethereum slightly smaller. Let's have a preview. Let's try to add some extra lightning. And let's say I want to rotate these lights. Not like that. Let's say somehow like that. Okay, that looks good. So now let's do a render. Okay, so let's say this one is ready. Let's add some folder. Let's call it uh, collection NFT folder. And, and of course it's going to be, mm, let's call it ETH, 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 ETH watch. 
let's say number number one so this is going to be like uh, the most expensive one the very first one and then we just click save so now in order to continue our collection we need to change something so we can choose the hair and you see you can hide the head and you can have something like this it's already can be number two but no let's keep the head we can change the hair now so let's just delete this hair let's switch to texture shaded so we deleted the hair now let's just change her hairstyle so let's make some short hair let's say like this so i double click i double click here okay since this is the force hair we will have to apply some simulation so let's just simulate quickly okay now let's um add some earrings you know like there will be with earrings without earrings like rarity and so on i don't know if i have any earrings face mask we can add actually face mask somehow like that and then we select our dream bolero neon dream bolero and we go to surfaces neon dream bolero and um let's say we want to change the color of it to red see it's giving like a reddish thing and the whole color let's make it purple so like this so this is going to be our other version we can choose the hair and we can change their color also to some kind of pink and then we just render one more time so let's make it thousand by thousand so that it will be a little bit faster let's do the render no let's cancel because i don't like the, the it's still the colors are still blue on her so let's make it toxic like this yeah it looks quite cool and i really want to put the earrings so let's find some earrings oh, there let's say this one's okay i like the way it looks so let's render this uh, you can have let's say first 10 with red ethereum and then basically you can make a green ethereum and you know this kind of like you can alternate your collection and then there will be like a rarity of the colors of ethereum rarity with earrings rarity with face mask without face mask uh, yeah you can just keep doing alternating everything so let's render this one okay so this one is ready let's make it number two safe and now one more will be with this neon suit because otherwise we will have to change this neon suit this will be our like uh, one of the collectibles rare rare, rare rare collectibles okay so let's let's go to surfaces and change the colors okay so now it will be glowing red and let's maybe change the hair let's remove the face mask Let's hide the earrings. Well, let's give her also maybe pink hair. Okay, looks great. Let's make this also. Okay, so that one is finished also. Let's go with number three and then we press save. So now let's get rid of this all the neon dream. Let's say this delete, delete. What was that mask? We will need it. Earrings, we will need it. And this we will have to delete and hair also we are going to delete okay now let's do a little bit more major changes so we leave hair for now let's do clothing sets and let's see some fantasy set what i have here what we have let's see so we can do either this cyborg no maybe like this something so let's try it on I double click on the model double click on the suit battle pilot full set there you go we're going to have this super battle pilot let's have a see how it looks in render yeah this is like uh wow let's see the colors what they offer so they offer this 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 yeah we can do some alternation with colors let's try this one yeah this looks cool and that's it we press render or actually you know what guys we can change the color of this ethereum so we go to our shaders let's try blue perfect so now we're gonna have like a 
three images with blue and this suit also will be kind of blue so it's gonna be like continue of the actual collection let's render this one so luckily as you can see this took us only 40 seconds because it's not much of glowing stuff going on so we're gonna call it number four and click save so we need two more different styles what was the name of it pilot suit their pilot suit so let's change the color okay i like because you can see the a little bit on the glass the actual shadow and then on the eye this is like a little bit more unique so let's render this one okay let's call it number five save now let's change the color again maybe pink or let's do red Yeah, let's do red. Okay, so this is number six. By the way, the most important, what we forgot to do is save. If something will happen now, then we can have a big trouble. So let's create new folder. Okay, so now we have three with the suit, three without suit. So let's change some other stuff right now. So we're going to delete all of this suit. So we have another suit. Let's see what they have. Yeah, I like this one. So we select the model and drop the suit. Let me drop the suit. Okay. And let's use this pink. Okay. Now let's um, let's change the diamond. Let's have a look. Okay, that looks quite awesome. Not as good as the other ones, but still it's kind of okay. Let's change the yes. Maybe let's try another one. Red we have already. Maybe transparent white. Black. Yeah, black. Black looks good. So let's do three series of this. That's it. Enough of this suit. Let's make some other clothes. Something like this. And basically that's how you do the collection. You just alternating whatever you can do and you keep a couple objects the same. Let's say the model is the same, the face mask is the same, the earrings I need to find is going to be one of the rare stuff and the diamonds colors basically. That's how you can approach this. Well, if you want animated, of course, like she's blinking or something, then it's just going to take much longer time in order to render each frame. So each frame have to be rendered separately. So you saw right now, like, okay, 30 seconds I have for just one picture. So let's say if she would be blinking, that would be around two seconds, one, two seconds, I would say. So it's 60 frames. So basically 60 times 30 seconds. That's how much you're going to get time in order to make animation. Yeah, that's why animations, they are a little bit more expensive on the NFT market. And they're not like thousands of, you know, thousands of pictures. So let's say this one, you can make thousands. So if I make 30, so in 10 days, you're going to get 300. So basically in one month, you can make 1000 pictures with all different kind of variations and um, let's see what we get so basically that's what we've got let's make it full screen so that's what we've got it's kind of you know like a short introduction of uh, like uh, how to make big collection you can change background in your editor wherever you edit your images or you can change background directly in uh, das studio which is gonna take a little bit longer the render or you can leave it as it is you see it's kind of transparent background so if you go on variable and you have dark mode then they will have dark background and if you have day mode they will have white background so basically that's what it's going to be but um, yeah so that's how you make collections they take a lot of time you know to make that's why they kind of worth of you know of paying something and you know like you choose whatever you like the most and then you just 
put it as a first one, then whatever. So let's say this is like original where we started from, we can put it as a first one, then this one will be the second, third, fourth, and so on. I'll make a collection and I think I will just continue this collection and I put it on the Rarible and we'll see what's gonna happen. Maybe somebody would like to buy, but yeah, I think it's gonna take one month for me to make it nice, maybe, maybe shorter than one month, but it, it is time consuming, but it pays off if your collection is good enough. So thank you very much for watching this tutorial and leave your comments below and of course share this video just to help me grow this channel a little bit faster. Thank you very much for watching and have a great designing.